Ladies and gentlemen, it is your lovely host here. Once again, it is Team Right Right. Anywho, have you got the opportunity to watch the very first video of the day? If not, smash that bell. You will get a notification from YouTube. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe. I have TikTok, Twitch, Twitter, my own Facebook page, and Instagram. Hopefully, that the government does not shut down TikTok in the United States. If so, that will be a huge shame. Especially, you can't really do nothing that much due to the virus and other stuff. You know, very, very depressing. But I think the president, off the record, needs to concentrate on other things besides um, banning TikTok. You know what I'm saying? But that's just me. Anywho. Once again, I will discuss wrestling news, wrestling topics, and a lot of awesome information to discuss for you. Now, if you like, sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, grab some drink. Now, if you don't do like that, maybe you want to chill like a villain and hear my amazing thoughts, my opinions, and the subject. And, of course, the article will be down below or the link will be down below. Let's roll this. Now, we all know that tomorrow night will be WWE extreme rules pay-per-view the house of horror they call it i don't know why but whatever now it supposed to be jeff hardy versus sheamus in a bar match but we decided to move it for next friday due to low ratings how can that match boost up the ratings it's not gonna help i'm being honest you know the Korean team is awful on Raw and SmackDown. McMahon, don't let these wrestlers go 110% on their character. Some of these characters are so watered down. It's awful. The ratings are so horrible. And especially with the, you know, you can't have full capacity with the fans right now. Eventually it's going to happen. You don't have a lot of these major players like no Lesnar, no Roman Reigns, no um, Sami Zayn, and there's other people are not on Raw SmackDown. So that's really hurting. But if they're there, the ratings are not up anyway. So it really doesn't matter if they're there or not there. You know what I'm saying? They need to change the whole format. That's just me, you know? They need to make more changes. Okay. As seen during Friday Night Smackdown broadcast, Matt Riddler faced off AJ Styles for an account title. Of course, AJ Styles retained. Uh, following Styles pick up the win, at, uh, extending his hand. And I guess Barry and Corbin beat the, he beat the crap out of him and attack Riddler. So I'm assuming they're going to have a match at the last minute at a Cream Rose Horror match. I think Baron Corbin, King Corbin, that whole character of him as a king is pointless, you know? He had won no championships since he won King of the Ring. It's so stupid. It's like when Sheamus won the King of the Ring back in the day. It was nothing for him. It's pointless, you know? It's, it's not like the good old days of King of the Ring, you know? So what's your thoughts on this whole information? Are you guys kind of upset that Sheamus and Jeff Hardy got pushed? For this Friday instead of tomorrow night on pay per view, or you guys don't give a flying crap, you know, just call it extreme rules, okay? You don't call it the horror of show shows. I guess they're gonna, I don't know, whatever. I guess the Bray Wyatt and Braun Strowman will be a cinematic kind of match. Hopefully, that match will deliver. If not, people will complain, like most of these wrestling fans, you know. I complain, but I usually keep it to myself. I don't complain on Twitter because no one does not read my tweets. So what's your thoughts? You know, and I guarantee that the ratings for, for SmackDown on Friday nights are very, very poor. I told you, everyone, when SmackDown moved to Fox on the first night, great ratings. And after a while, it's going to go down, down, down because you don't have the rock there. You don't have these... People that you grew up with. It's, it's you know, it's... I just don't understand why W can't 
have new stars and boost up their ratings every freaking Friday night. That was a stupid decision. Have it back on return on Friday nights. They should leave on Tuesday nights, but whatever. Anyway, have a good one. Stay safe. Wash your flipping hands. Stay away from people. Let me know how's the weather in your area. And um, enjoy the rest of your Saturday. And I'll be back tomorrow. Don't forget, this Monday will be my Extreme Rules House of Horror review. If you guys and gals are very, very curious. Peace out and thanks for watching.